Today we are here on behalf of Muslim Aid to raise money for Muslim Aid's Girls Empowered campaign, which is to raise money for our education programs uh, around the world. We have in our lineup uh, Mehdi Hassan, who is uh, a well-known journalist for Al Jazeera and various other shows, and hosting is Miriam Francois. So we're very excited about that. Uh, it's a pleasure to be back here in the UK, in London, and it's a great pleasure and privilege to be here for the first time at the invitation of Muslim Aid, a British Muslim charity established in Britain, which reaches six million people globally from the UK. There's a saying of the Prophet, peace be upon him, that I'd like to share with you, and that is that the believer is kind and gracious, but there is no goodness in one who is neither kind nor gracious, and the best of people are those who are most beneficial to others. I believe it is this philosophy that Muslim Aid is undertaking. 62 million girls right now will never see a primary school education. And that is what Muslim Aid tonight want to start to do something about. Last year, tens of thousands of children, especially girls, supported around the world by Muslim Aid. Crisis UK, a homelessness charity in the UK, works with Muslim Aid. Jewish charities work with Muslim Aid. This is a charity that is going out of its way to try and reach out across borders and walls. Uh, today was a event of amazing inspiration between the community in London and wide. Muslim Aid done a fantastic job raising the profile of women and young females in youth education. I found it inspiring. If we don't educate our women, we're not educating our children, we're not educating our villages, our towns. So it's the woman that needs to be educated, that she can pass on that knowledge to her children, her grandchildren and the people that are in her community.